Hassam. I'm a senior lecturer for postgraduate clinical pharmacy. The program that I teach on is the independent prescribing course for pharmacists. So it's basically a course that qualified pharmacists take, which can last between four to six months, in which they will then hopefully become prescribers at the end of the course. I did my MPharm here, so my master's in pharmacy I did at DMU as an undergraduate. Um, and I also did my postgraduate here as well. So clearly I love the place because I'm back again now. When I was an undergraduate, um, having conversations with my lecturers about working in academia as a pharmacist was something that really motivated me from, from even that age. So we're talking around maybe when I was 19, 20, um, that eventually I would want to get into academia um, as, part of, as part of working as a pharmacist professional. And so when I did my postgraduate here, um, I, I then had the opportunity to sort pursue this further um, and so I initially started working here in more of a visiting lecturer role supporting existing students um, and then when an opportunity became available for um, a permanent full-time vacancy I basically jumped at it and, and luckily I was given the opportunity to work on on the independent prescribing course. So um, what, what I've particularly enjoyed about working and even studying in the Leicester School of Pharmacy is the fact that pharmacy is an ever-changing profession. So, um, so there's multiple different sectors, but also there's changes that come through, not only through developments in medicine and research, but also changes by our professional and regulatory bodies. And the Leicester School of Pharmacy has always sort of tried to embrace those changes and reflect them upon the material that we teach our students. And that's something that I've both appreciated as a student at the school, as well as a staff member. I think it's really important to when working within um, this kind of context to not become desensitized to the fact that eventually it is patients who um, will be the eventual recipients of the standard of education that we provide um, and maintaining the fact that, that patient care is and should be one of our top priorities. Um, so I really appreciate and, and enjoy the fact that I can teach that level of um, sort of standards and care to, to my students so that they can deliver that high standard of care to, to their own patients going forward. I'm local to Leicester, so I've lived here my entire life. Um, I love the fact that I can literally walk to work within 20 minutes each day. Um, and, so, and so that's one of the many things that, that I enjoy and also the fact that it is extremely sort of multicultural. So um, that's something that I, that I appreciate in the fact that you know, it's, it's a place where I've always felt comfortable, whether it be as a student or as an employee and it's, it's a place I genuinely enjoy coming to.